Changes are coming for millions of Americans with student loans. Today, the Biden administration announced it's canceling up to $10,000 of student loans that are federal for borrowers who make under $125,000 a year. Now, if you are within that income range and also received a Pell Grant, you can seek forgiveness for up to $20,000 of your loans. Biden says the move will allow borrowers to put their money to other uses. People can start, uh, finally crawl out from under that mountain of debt to get on top of their rent and their utilities, to finally think about buying a home or starting a family or starting a business. The White House also announced it's extending the pause in student loan repayment for one last time this year. The U.S. Department of Education announced no payments will be required on federal student loans until January of 2023. So with this new announcement from the White House today, what does this mean for students right here in Nevada? Well, reporter Kay McCabe has the details on how students could see relief here. It's exciting to see it. An exciting change. Many people paying off their student loans will now have help with President Biden's newly announced student loan forgiveness plan. College students like Joe Wallace and Nicole Mitten say they're happy to see it finally come to fruition. 10,000, it might sound like not sound like a lot, uh, but a lot of us got in state tuition, so that will cover a good chunk of it. Wallace is now working on her master's degree at UNLV, but says it was hard during her undergrad years working multiple jobs to pay for school. I worked all throughout my undergrad. I worked at Target and JCPenney and like a bunch of retailers basically. Um, and like I had friends that didn't have to work because their parents like paid for their school or whatever. And it really like highlighted the difference to me. Minton says it was difficult to watch her parents deal with lifelong student debt. My dad's in that boat. He went to school and he's never going to pay off his loans and he's just accepted that moving forward in life. And while the two say they are relieved to get some help, the president's plan won't cover everyone's debt. Elaine Rubin, director of communications at Advisors, says with the White House announcement, she's advising people to stay on their current payment plans as not everyone will qualify. There are millions who still will have a student loan balance at the end and you need to be prepared for repayment and understand how the this is going to impact you. Not everyone's going to qualify and not everyone is going to have their balance completely wiped out. And people looking for more information on today's White House announcement about student loans turn to the federal government's website and this is what they found. Those logging on studentaid.gov were greeted with this message right here, warning that the site was struggling under the high volumes of visitors. At last check, it took almost a minute for that website to load. So once again, visitors found a message at the top of the page alerting them that some pages may take longer to display than usual because of the increase in the interest in this student loan forgiveness.